right, guys, what's up? We're here with uh, John, been a longtime patient of mine, and uh, we just want to kind of give you a good idea of what you know a real uh, good therapeutic adjustment looks like. Um, you can make things pop, that's easy to do, but to get it right and really make sure that we're adjusting the right things is important to me because I want to get good results. So um, with John, we're going to, uh, we've been treating his hip, so we're going to assess his, we've been treating kind of his full spine and hip, so we're going to assess his, uh, you guys should stay uh, seated okay. there, yeah. We're going to assess his lower back, his middle back, neck, and then his hip. So this is called motion palpation, and what I'm looking for is where the restrictions are in his back. And you could feel a little bit right down at the bottom. John's an avid runner, so he tends to uh, get a little tight in the low back region. And, and up in here, huh, John? This yeah. Area. You're saying your neck's a little tight today, yeah. right? Yeah, it's really, so your joints are moving pretty good here, but really where the problem is, is kind of more in here, which is, yeah. we find that often. That's what we found last time we treated you too. Yeah. All right, so let's go ahead and lay on your right side. So I have a good idea of where I want to adjust John, it's gonna be in the safe room, but I'm gonna uh, evaluate it a little more thoroughly here, and we're gonna see, is it, is he having problems going this way, or is he having problems going backwards? And it's more going backwards, more in what we would call extension right there. So I'm gonna roll the wind to me here. Good, that's a little movement there. Let's go on your other side. Good. And same thing on this side, we want to get exactly where the movement restriction is. Okay. Yeah, that's feeling better. I heard it pop just before. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's going to your uh, tummy. Okay. Yeah, it's, the low back's loosened up for sure. Go ahead and take a nice deep breath in and out. So one of the things I picked up when I was evaluating him seated is that his extension is restricted, so going back that way. So we're adjusting him for, and then with his neck, it was actually, he's having trouble going like this. So we're gonna adjust him for that. That always releases really nicely in there. I think it's maybe the way you sit at work, John, or yeah. hold yourself at work. Maybe when you're running, maybe you look down too much. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go on your back. So that was the spine, we're gonna do the um, hip now. And with hip, you know, it's the same thing. We wanna check all ranges of motion. So is he having trouble doing that? Is he having trouble? This is usually where we see the problem. Now, this was hard and fixed about, you know, a month ago. That feels pretty good. Yeah. And how's your running been? It's been really good, actually. Good. All right, so he's already got his hands up there. He knows what's coming. You ready? Yeah. Ooh, yeah. That was a big release. That yeah, was. <laughs> we'll check this side, too. Let's see it. He's a runner, so I like to make sure he's all tuned up. Bad. This one usually doesn't release as much. Yeah, yeah nice and stable yeah. in there. All right, John, very good. Thank you. Yes, sir. Uh -huh.